Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome. I'm Black Operation One, aka Bops TV One. And today, we are trying a new, uh, a new game out. It's called Life Z. It's a su zombie survival game. Um, I had a little play just to see if it's worth doing videos on, and it is pretty good. So basically, it's a zombie survival crafting game. You gotta hunt around, um, you know, collect resources, um, whilst also trying to avoid the zombies and trying to survive as long as you can. Um, about the UI, we'll show the UI. So we have our hot bar down here. We have four slots of a hot bar. We have our hunger, our thirst, and our health. Uh, what we got equipped in our hand. What we got equipped. Uh, basically um, what we can action on like you know if you've got like a bandage in there or some food you can uh, quickly eat that um, this section here is how much damage uh, your equipped weapon or even your fists how much damage they do um, and that bottom icon there is your armor no it's not actually I don't know what actually no, I don't know what that is because that's your armor I do apologize that is your armor how much armor you got and percentage? Um, I'm not sure what that one does either, actually. So I don't know what those two bottom icons do. But and then we got crafting menus, so we can craft a few items here. Um, there is quite a few. We can go down to guns and right shields and all sorts of things there. Of course, each one requires different resources, which we've got to hunt around for. We have buildings, so we can build. Um, basically somewhere to live and stay and then we have a backpack now i have a few items in the backpack as you saw me collect from these storage bins over here like so so we're going to access we've got some trousers which add five percent armor so we drag them to our leggings there and some boots that add 10 armor um we are going to want our that one we want to um equip some of these so we go control one for that. So when we press, sorry, control two. So when we press two, we can swap between our axe and our pickaxe there. And um, we do have some food. Um, gonna need some water and of course we are gonna need some bandages. I'm gonna leave that one there. Now we've got some more stuff in here. We have a machete, we've got some rope, we've got some cloth. We're going to need some cloth because what we need to do is make a better bag. So this is the light bag. We're going to need rope and we're going to need cloth. Now there is rope in here, so we're going to swap it that water there. Collect that rope. Um, nope, wrong one. We're going to come to the crafting. We're going to craft... I forgot you need a space infantry. Um, craft up a light backpack which will increase so we've got an extra four slots there now these you can have um 16 slots in total uh yeah eight, 16 16 slots in total so we have now got uh 12 slots there with that light back back now we can carry more items uh we are going to take machete blade but of course we can drop that if need be um the same with that we've took all the items from there um for the treatment of wounds, hunger, thirst, and health 35. Health 35. Okay, so we're not going to take any more of that. Let's uh, take... So, let's gather some stones here. Like so, no here. Zombie. A lot of the movement and stuff you can move by WS, uh, WSA and D, but that's what the movement looks like. You're not really, you're just jumping around spots. So it's all about point and click. Um, yeah, I've got my infantry to fall, so we're going to need that. We're going to need our pick, get some stones there. I will use a WS and D, but it's just going to look very weird, so I do apologize for that. This is uh, on sale, I think, at the moment on Steam. Um, grab, so grab yourself a bargain while you can. 
I think the new Steam sale ends on Monday. Um, not bad. I think it's like two quid this game. So yeah, not bad for two quid if it's just like little zombie games. Oh, oh crap. Let's kill him. Let's uh, press one. So now you can see we have bandages equipped down here. So if we press Q, we heal up 35. Now the zombies in that you can these can sometimes drop items. Oh, zombie. So we need to find our home. We have in a minute we will see the map. You've got to come to the um edge of the zone here. Look. Now I have played a bit of this, like I said, just to try it out. So I do know the basics. Um so a military forces drop supply box. So there is a supply box there. We're not going to go to that yet. But this is the area. Um, okay. Now, red is obviously um, hard. Like the dark red is probably even harder. I don't know about that. But the reds are hard. The oranges are semi-hard. Greens are easy for like the zombie difficulties. Um, and this is our home here. Uh, we need to go home. So we're going to go home. We need to... Hang on, we're supposed to be home. Are we home? This don't look like home. Are we home? Did I click home? Yeah, home. Move here. Enter. Okay, I did. Well, when I played, like I said, when I tried this out... Home was just an empty space. So we're gonna... Uh, we are gonna quickly... Um, lay down... No, not one there, sorry. Um, we're gonna lay down a box here. Oh no, we can't, can we? We can lay... Why can't we lay that one down? Okay. Maybe we need to leave the area. Okay, let's do this. Let's, let's, let's enter here. Oh crap. Straight into zombies. So Q, take a bandage. You die. You die. And then it will come back out. Move here. No, still not. Okay, this could be a game bug, which is not a great start, obviously. Um, okay, we'll gather some stuff. Kill that bitch. Yeah, die, right. Um... Let's have a look. Can we lay flooring down? Oh, so we can lay flooring down. Okay. We're a bit thirsty, so we're going to have to access here. I'll swap that down to there. Let's refill our drink up here. And swap it over again. I actually might need to take a bit of food as well. Let's do that. Uh, bandages down there. It's always handy to have the bandages on your quick uh, quick user slot. Quick item. You, you your item slot, sorry. For quick use. These trees are very loud. Very loud. Um, swap to that. So we get some more stone. And then we want to go back to the building menu. Going to build a little three by three. I think should do us for now. We can always extend it. Um, oh, okay. What happened there? Uh, put a door there. All right. So we're right of wood. Of course, we're going to need some more wood. Um. Actually, that will 
crap. Two zombies at once. I need to try and like focus onto one zombie at a time. Even though they both can hit you. Oh crap, no one. Maybe once we cleared this area, right? Maybe then Oh this is a bigger zombie. Okay. Bigger zombie but easier to take down. It's logic. Three logs from that. Kill that zombie. Now each weapon has uh, durability, of course. Um, yeah. Be a bit OP if everything was invincible. So bad in here. Let's put our door in first. So we know it's going to go there. Let's put that there. So, so we're going to do a little... Oh, just got an achievement. Small trees over here. Oh, no, no I want to click a tree. Thank you. And I'm going to put that one there. And then we can put our furniture in. So we have a couple of storage boxes here. Now this is a water buck which we can put out there so we can collect water from when it rains. So now we have our storage we can start unloading items into here. Um, we're not going to need that at the moment. We're not going to need that. That one there might come in handy. But I don't think it's going to come in handy just yet. Um, Let's put that one as control one, that one as control four. So that seems okay, right. Okay, onwards and upwards. So we need to gather some more wood. We've got to get a workbench up and running now. So where's the workbench? Bench. There it is, workbench. Uh, so we need some iron ore and some more trees. We need uh, 20 trees in, a, in total, 20 wood. Don't know why I call it trees. You can't really carry a whole tree in your pocket. No. Or in your bag. But see, with this being here, look, when you can now take all this. Huh? Look at this, look. Take all that. Nothing in there. Take all that, and then we can run that back. See, run that back, put it into our storage. Uh, we want to click two. Go to that, click one. So we need one more log. So we'll go to this one, this should be enough. Right. So let's go back home here. Let's unload that into there. That one, and bandages, yeah we need the bandages, don't we? Put that one into there, that one into there. Um, now we are going to need to try and get some iron here. So we need to find some iron ore. So we might need to go and explore another location. Get iron ore. Hello. Die. Die. Oh, penis. Didn't mean to do that. Let's put that one down there. Oh, that's on the head saying. Oh, okay. We can do with that. Let's collect that. So we're just getting stone from here. So I'm going to look around and around, find some iron, look some iron ore, and then, yeah, go back home. Let me meet you back at home.
Okay, so we're in a new location. We're on the mountains. We've got some iron. So, let's get some of this iron ore here. So, we got three. And how many do we need? And uh, we need three. So, we can craft up the workbench now, which is nice. Uh, so, you know, what we need the workbench for is to make these flat boards so we can get like the furnace and start getting so we can start making um iron ingots to make the proper pickaxe and steel axe and all that um we are going to make the bonfire next we need more we've got logs of stone at home we've got some rope home we're going to need some grass which should be no bueno should be easy sorry not no bueno no bueno means you know bad news so. It's not bad news, is it? It's good news. Yeah. Exactly. What am I talking about? No way, no. Okay, so you die. We'll gather, like I said, a couple more ore. And we'll head back. Back home. Move here. Enter. Hello, home. Right. So now we are home. We can click our saw. Click furniture. And we can place the furniture. So we're going to place our workbench there. Now in our workbench, if we have a look at recipes. So four log equals one board. And you got some different logs there. So we're going to grab the logs we got. We've got to grab a rope we got. And our stone. And we also got to go and get some plants. So let's go around to find some grass. Sorry, not plants. Let's find some grass here. Uh, this should be a little bit easy, right? So let's have a look. Uh, so we have enough, so let's craft that up. And this take back. Can some more of this, get some planks on the go as well. Ooh, didn't pick that up. Get some more planks on the go. Well not more planks, get some planks on the go. Crafting items I haven't done that. Alright, so we're coming here. Put that to there, it takes 30 seconds to create one, which is fair enough. Now we need that one, so we need to click that one, go to furniture. Let's put him... Let's put him there, I think, that would be a nice spot. So now we can cook up food, as you can see. So we have carrots, potatoes, we have fish, and we have raw meat. Okay. We're going to put our iron, we're going to put our rope, we're going to put our stone. In the, actually, no, we're going to keep our stone and we're going to keep our rope. Oh, shit, I just took all. I made a boo-boo. That's -boo. <laughs> medical clothes. Because um, we want to make the drying rack next. So we want a small rope and 20 logs. So to make you can make rope by gathering plants. Um... Stone, some logs, a nice zombie. Hello, let's have a little food there. Right, we need 20, don't we? So, is that two, three, that's six. Nine, ten.
Okay, so we have enough um, enough wood, enough logs. So now we need to just find the grass to make the rope. Now to make rope, we need three grass each. And it doesn't seem to be much grass left here. So there's one. There's two. So we might have to go and explore another area. I don't know. Might be right, because we have rope at home. Let's have a look here. Oh no, we left. No, we kept our rope on us. I do apologise. So we're gonna click that. Craft, craft, craft. So now we have a seven rope. Oh, how much grass do we have? One, two grass shy. Damn. Okay. Let's come to here. Let's go down to here. There's one. Unless we can get some rope off a zombie. Which is going to be quite rare. We've got potato tubers. If you plant it, great potatoes grow. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Digging that one. Do with some potatoes. We can make some baked potato. There's all the grass. There's some grass over here. Okay, do we have enough? Yes, we do. So we have that, and then we can craft up the drying rack. So, let's go back home. And let's place our drying rack. So we're going to place it in this corner here. I like that so yeah so the drying rack uh you put two grass in equals rope so it's one less than if you craft normal but five uh basically hide and you get one leather strap now we do have some of that we have eight so we're gonna get that we're gonna put that one in there um so it takes two minutes so that's that's not too bad so we also have four of them four planks and we need five, so we've got to craft one more. We've got to get some more iron. Um, some more iron ore, some more stone, and some more wood. But we're going to do that on the next episode. So I hope you've enjoyed. If you have, please smash the thumbs up button. And if you're new to the channel, please subscribe and show your support. It is appreciated. Also, please check out my mate's link. He done a lot of channel art. Um, go over there. You know, say a big thank you, show love to his channel. So yes, thank you for watching, and until next time, remember to have fun, keep gaming, and I will see you on the next video. Goodbye.